You've probably heard that the upcoming One UI 7.0 update will make a lot of changes to how Samsung's Android software looks and feels. But interestingly, one of the most important changes in One UI 7.0 is actually something small and subtle. If the leaked screenshots of One UI 7.0 are true, Samsung plans to completely change the battery icon in the status bar. The new update is expected to replace the current battery icon with a pill-shaped one. It might not seem like a big deal, but this simple redesign is more important than it looks, especially if you know the history of One UI and TouchWiz. From what I can see, the status bar battery indicator hasn't really changed much since the release of TouchWiz Nature UI 3.0 and the Galaxy S5 back in 2014. For the last 10 years, we have pretty much the same battery icon in the status bar, a simple, single-color, vertical battery shape with a lightning bolt on top when the phone is charging. Even before TouchWiz Nature UI 3.0 came out in 2014, the battery icon was similar, except it was multicolored with a green inside and a white outline. Over the past decade, only a few small changes have been made to the battery indicator. The corners have become a bit rounder, but that's pretty much all that's changed. I know that switching from the familiar design to the new pill-shaped battery indicator won't drastically change the user experience. Some people might not even like it because adjusting to change can be difficult. To me, this is one of the most interesting changes because the battery icon hasn't been updated in such a long time. It adds to the idea that Samsung might be putting extra effort into the One UI 7.0 update, just as some rumors suggested. The redesign feels significant because of the icon's long history, at least that's how I see it. Maybe I'm more excited about this change than I should be, but either way I'm really looking forward to One UI 7.0. Also, we are going to see a new feature in the One UI 7.0. According to ex-user Megaboy, One UI 7 will be getting battery health and battery cycle count. As we can see in the screenshot, we have the battery status, battery level, battery capacity, battery health, and in the second last we have the battery cycle count option. And at the end we have manufacture date. I hope Samsung releases the first beta update soon. While the company hasn't announced a date yet, rumors suggest the beta might come out in September. I hope you liked the video. If you enjoyed the video, subscribing to the channel would be greatly appreciated. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.